government's plan to avoid defaulting on its loans. Is that the unemployment keeps rising and it has to keep rising just because we have an excess so much supply so of goods, which is this is all to borrowed money that our and that kids debt is owned by banks in other countries. In the form of a convenient filter cigarette that delivers the taste and I 45 malt liquor. Are you hot? Is you know, economists are in fact not economists at all. They're propagandists of money value. This system is more wasteful than all the other existing systems in the history of the planet. So you're really dealing with not an economic system, but I would go so far as to say an anti-economic system. There is no profit under the current paradigm in saving lives, putting balance on this planet, having justice uh, and peace or anything else. Disease supports medicine. It supports doctors and hospitals. But if you really were able to eliminate most diseases, you would eliminate professions as well. You have to create problems to create profit. But that's a reflection of the culture in which we live, in which we've all, to one degree or another, endorsed. I think the biggest barrier would be the values that people are taught to uphold that system. At the social level of life organization, it isn't a genetic program or a genetic defect. It's a value system a disorder. In the past, throughout almost all of human history, the main threat to human survival was nature. Today, it is culture. So the system has to be corrected, not print more money and give it to banks. That doesn't deal with the problem. problems that we have today will continue to go on. This will never go away within a monetary system. It's clear that we're on the verge of a great transition in human life. That what we face now is this fundamental change of the life we've known over the last century. There has to be a link between the economy and the resources of this planet. The resources being, of course, all animal and plant life, the health of the oceans and everything else. This is a monetary paradigm that will not let go until it's killed the last human being.